Hey everybody, this is Done43 with just another update. Uh, full of stuff happening, so I'm not going to really have any topics really based on. Uh, right now you're looking at um, my desk, which I have just finished cleaning up. Well, sort of cleaning up. It seems to be a huge mess, and right now I'm going to uh, getting it cleaned up so I can use it for um, doing model jobs and uh, stuff on it so I don't have to be doing it on the floor like where I was over there and um, then I'm gonna be uh, then I've been cleaning up this ledge over here and um, this ledge will just be um, well once I get it cleaned up I'm gonna go to uh, the hobby shop uh, grab some Bachman easy track straights and just line them two rows will do and then I could put stuff that I'm going to be working on, that I could be working on, and uh, maybe overflow of freight and uh, locomotives. It could be going up there. And uh, it should turn out quite nicely. I'm getting so close. Uh, however, I'm not going to, however, I'm not really advancing until we can, we can get behind the desk and uh, vacuum. Uh, there would be lots of cobwebs behind there and um, little surprises, which uh, I don't really like. So, um, we're going to have to get behind there before we do anything else. And uh, then I have some more updates which are coming up. Here we are at the uh, layout. And uh, right now you're looking at an uh, AC44CP9504. Uh, just, um, yeah, I know you're getting tired of the weathering. But I completed weathering on it. Um, so, I've done all the rusting and stuff on it. I've done a full line of rusting along here it's a bit more lighter than at the front over here and then you can kind of see some rust on the lettering which uh, is more realistic because the lettering is usually all um, wiped away on this type of paint and then I've rusted the fuel tank I haven't done it underneath or on the trucks because uh, I kind of don't really want to do underneath there there's a whole bunch of little uh, holes and stuff and then we're going to move behind here, and you can kind of see lots more rust on this side of the fuel tank. And uh, then there's not lot, really lots of rust here, but I have completed the rusting and stuff. And uh, it's turning out really nicely on this engine. And then I've also been doing some rusting here, and then more rust on the plow. And then I've done rusting on the uh, strip here that's uh, just above the ditch lights. And uh, it's turning out very nice. Uh, I did have a little problem last night. I uh, the um, antenna uh, came off, and uh, realized oh, it's just glue holding it, which was quite surprising. Um, but I just got, took some glue and glued it back on. But then there's still the uh, manufacturer's glue line sticking out. But it was crooked before, and uh, now I got it into a correct place. And it's all straight now. So um, I'm pretty glad about that, even though not happy that it came off. And then there's all the other weathering and stuff. And then I'm work and then the 9502 has uh, not received anything else from last update. Uh, it's all the same. As you can see, there's no rusting on here. So it looks really different compared to 9504. So um, that's really all everything I guess. Uh, so hopefully I can get on to uh, cleaning back and the room. And then I have um, what I have ordered through um, the hobby shop is one of the new Athern RTR um, Gunderson High Cube boxcars, the 60 foot ones. And I'm getting the one in CP uh, paint. And I am really excited about that, although it's going to take a lot out of my pocket, but I have a sibling who will be uh, paying for some of it if he wants to uh, use this layout too. So, anyways. And then I also plan on getting this controller um, substituted and replaced with a um, one of the new easy uh, command controls, controls, which I'm really happy to get. Uh, although I don't really have any money to get it yet, but I hopefully will get it soon as possible, and uh, that'd be awesome to have. So it's really about it with the updates, I guess. Um, 
that's all I really had. There was no really much topics. So, um, yeah, this is Done43, and uh, good luck.